Hello everyone, we're on page 287. We're going to look at example 3, find the missing values. So I've copied this diagram over here. Now, angle A is 2x degrees and angle B is 2x degrees. So that means the opposite sides are congruent. So opposite of angle A is right here. Opposite of angle B is right here. And that's why we know we have an e a, uh, equilateral triangle because if BC is congruent to AC and AC is congruent to AB, we have three congruent sides. Now, also given to us is that side BC is 4Y minus 5. So now we can solve for angle, you know, angle for X and Y. So first of all, we know that 2x plus 2x, we have an equilateral triangle, so we know this is 60 degrees. We know this is equal to 60, and this is equal to 60. Because it's equilateral, all three angles must be 60 degrees. That's always true in an equilateral triangle. So that means that 2x equals 60, divide both sides by 2, x is 30 degrees. Now to find what the measure of what y is, we know that 4y minus 5, this side, is equal to ac. So 4y minus 5 equals 3. Add 5 to both sides. 4y equals 8, divide by 4, y equals 2. Okay, pause the video, go ahead and do the guide practice right here. And then resume it to see how you did. All right, so we need to find x and y again. So we have these two sides are congruent. So that means that this uh, angle and this angle are congruent. Notice we don't have an equilateral triangle this time because this angle is not 60 degrees. Remember that the... So that means that... Uh, this angle plus this angle plus this angle must equal 180. So we could write 6x plus 8. This has to be the same. So this angle here is 6x plus 8. Plus 80 equals 180. Okay, combine your like terms. 12x plus 96 equals 180. Subtract that 96, 12x equals 84, divide by 12, x equals 7. So that means that if x is 7, you know, you get 42 plus 8, this is 50 degrees right here, that's 50 degrees, and that makes sense, 50 plus 50 plus 80 is 180. And then our final step is to solve for y. Well, this side must be the same length as this side. So that means that 4y minus 2 is equal to 2y plus 2. Add 2 to both sides. 4y equals 2y plus 4. Subtract 2y from both sides. 2y equals 4. Divide by 2, y equals 2.